Hello folks, Gordon here, hope all is well with you. Now then, what's the lighting looking like on this? Oh, yeah, not great, it's not that bright today, it's a bit gloomy. Um, oh, it might just be my phone, I'm looking a bit shadowy, but I'm going to carry on. This video I've called Christmas Tat. <laughs> I was at a shopping centre yesterday, the fifth largest shopping centre in the UK. And I know that because I googled it. It's the kind of information that I like to Google. <laughs> I was at the fifth largest shopping centre in the UK and as I was mooching around the shops, something you would find at this time of year is that the Christmas shops appear in shopping centres that just sell Christmas tat. That's not all tat, it's not all rubbish in there. They sell the decorations and the tinsel. Oh, I can't help, I get drawn to the, the racks of tinsel, all the big fluffy sparkly tinsel. I love it, all that kind of, I just get drawn to it. Some of the stuff in this shop, in these Christmas shops, these special units are, it is Christmas tat. Not particularly well made or good looking and quite expensive, some of it. And normally when I'm mooching around, I just sort of walk past it and look at it, enjoy some of it, laugh at some of it and, you know, don't buy anything. Very tempted to buy something yesterday. I didn't, but I was really tempted. I saw a train um, and it's a bit, how can I describe the train? Like if you imagine a nostalgic sort of cartoon cr tr train with a Christmas feel to it from childhood. That's what it looked like. It was, a, you know, a steam engine uh, train and it had sort of perspex around and inside was Santa, a Christmas tree, a little child with presents and glitter going everywhere and it was lit up. So obviously it's powered, battery powered, glitter going lit up. Now you might think, ooh, that sounds, sounds a bit tatty. But it was... I don't know, it, was, it looked nice to me. I liked it. It had a certain something to it. it. Drew me in as soon as I saw it. And I checked the price. Because I thought, oh, that's interesting. I wonder how much that is. And it was £30. So I didn't buy it, but I was very nearly tempted to buy it. And it made me think of my own Christmas offer because I nearly spent £30 on a Christmas decoration that I, you would then bring out every year and display it and smile when you look at it. And it made me think of my own Christmas offer, which is not £30, it's only £15. And my Christmas offer is to do with that, that painting. That painting is, now that's the original painting. Uh, eight by eight canvas panel board, so they're thin. That is acrylic, and I painted that in 2021, two years ago. Now that original painting, you could buy that if you wanted. That is 75 pounds, and you could bring that out every year and display it as part of your Christmas decorations. But I do prints. You can see a couple of them in the shadow there, looking up there, because the light's not great today, is it? But here's a print on a soft touch card, an official print from uh, me, a 15 pounds, not 30 pounds, only 15 pounds. And you can bring that up, uh, bring that out and display it every year as part of your annual Christmas decorations. You can have a little smile when you look at it and maybe think of me every Christmas. That would be fun, wouldn't it? Uh, and you can, you can either, display it as it is and just lean it up against something if you want to or they work well in in a frame as well now i don't i don't sell these frames but they're only i think it was five or six pounds and i can tell you where i got them from i can't even remember at the moment whether it was amazon or ebay i really should i, I have to look through my records but it works well in a frame as well so yeah uh and there's this year's, that, that was this year's Christmas painting. 
that are painted and you can have well you could buy this original for 75 pounds or you could buy a print of this for uh, 15 pounds so yeah it made me think of my own offer not 30 pounds and it made me realize people do spend obviously 30 pounds on a Christmas decoration that they bring out once a year about 15 pounds for some some artwork to include as part of your decorations and it's got that certain extra something to it because you know who painted it yeah that would be me let me know let me know what you think I'd love to hear your thoughts and of course if you'd like to buy one I forgot to say I've got 50 of these prints hand signed and hand numbered So these haven't got, they're not signed and they're not numbered yet because I do that when someone buys them. So yeah, uh, message me if you'd like to find out more or if you want to buy one. Um, and that's it, I think, I think I'm going to sign off for now. I've got a couple of other questions that I wanted to ask you about art, but I'm going to save those for another video. Yes, L let me know what you think. I'd love to hear your thoughts. Leave a comment below where you happen to be seeing this video. Signing off for now and wishing you as ever health and happiness and I'll speak to you again soon.